Hi Taurus, welcome to your monthly forecast for the month of April. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Alright. Mmm. Oh, money. Good communications, good news. Okay, let's just put this up. Looks like there are a lot of things that you need to do and choose for your job. Mm, it's like you're, you know, you're trying to make a decision right now, but there are a lot of things that you still have to consider. So don't rush into anything. Or I feel like this is not really the right month for you to make any major change when it comes to your job. Let's take a look at your love life. Looks like something is really about to come to an end. Anyway, we'll see. You know, um, for much more clarifications later on. like you want to cover up your past but you know you know you know that there is something that's already starting to rot in your relationship and that involves your sex life um By the way, if there's any um, uh, medical condition or if there's any um, like medical procedure that you need to go through, better ask and research first before saying yes. Because I feel like, uh, you know, it's much better for you to be much more aware rather than just going for it and to believe in you know, just one opinion. Okay, well, good news that's coming your way, you know, money that you're expecting, a job interview, a job offer, you know, um, also unexpected money from, a, from an unknown resource, or uh, receiving an inheritance as well, or uh, like an insurance claim. This is the perfect month for you to, you know, to save up and invest. And I also feel like, you know, there's something about stocks or, you know, like um, like an investment in the past that will finally be coming to fruition and you'll be very happy because, you know, right after all those years that you've been like saving and putting up your, your, your money to, into this, finally, it is going to be paying off, okay? Plus, I feel like some of you will be uh, celebrating your anniversary and you will be uh, forming or um, like uh, organizing an event or party for everyone to come 
and I feel like you will be very very happy with the outcome okay even with the suppliers and caterers and whatever it is work wise things will also start becoming even more light and money will also be more into you know money will also be more into your favor and the increment that you've been looking and waiting and asking for finally your boss will be giving it to you and there will be some more changes that will be coming your way and i feel like your boss will finally be um you know like uh, um appreciating your contributions now i feel like you and your spouse are finally um coming into terms where you're trying to you know appease each other and uh, you know the things that have already like pushed you to the edge before and you're trying to save up your marriage or you're trying to save up your relationship at this moment however there will be some things that will be getting in the way which is kind of inevitable i feel and you just need to make your partner understand and since that you're already trying to work things out why don't you try to prolong each other's patience anyway because both of you are going through some big transformation and positivity and i feel like you, you know instead of bickering back and forth all you needed to do right now is support each other and understand you know their career path and success but in overall i'm getting a lot of good stuff good money good news people that will be coming your way people that will also be helpful and people that will be paying you off their you know whatever they owe you in the past all of a sudden and you'll be very um you know you'll be very happy about it now When it comes to your career, even though things are slowly moving up right now, you feel like you're already starting to, you know, I mean, you're feeling burned out, which is just normal. But you want to make more money. You want to have more. You want to have more position. You want to have more exposure. With this job, yeah, you know, finally the management is giving you whatever you want because I feel like you've already threatened your boss that if you, they are not going to hike up your price or, you, you know, like raise your salary, then you're just going to take off and that's it, you know. But you know, it's a good thing that this month they will hear you and they will be appreciating and reviewing your performance and they're going to be pleased, you know, with whatever result they're going to get. But... You know that there is something else that you really want to do and there is something else that you want to explore yourself to and you are always thinking either you know right after your retirement or what or you want to file for an early retirement and i feel like this you know at this point you want to make some changes and there is something in the past that you really want to pursue that the reason why you did not do it in the past is because lack of money or lack of resources plus your partner doesn't even understand that's you know why you need to do that but now you will have the money you will have the people you will have the crowd and you will have the support and everything else that you already needed right now and the only thing that's missing is that of course you're still working and that your your work is consuming a lot of your time but this month if there is something that you really want to pursue that you've been dreaming about in the past, this is the perfect time. And I feel like you will also be getting the right support, especially from an air sign person. Now, when it comes to your love life. Oh, well, a brand new beginning. Well, your health is also something that you need to watch out for. And... You know, your partner is, they're the one who has a lot of issues, not you. Because at this point that you've been trying to extend a lot more of yourself to this relationship, they are the one who's been showing a lot more unhappiness and miseries. And uh, they're too miserable in their own life. And they want to move out for a little while or they want to seek themselves or, you know, do some soul searching. That even though as much as you don't want this to happen, that you feel like, oh, come on, you know, we're already going through some couples therapy. We're going to the marriage counseling and stuff like that. And now you want to be allowed and you will still want to go, you know. If you, they wanted to go, let them, okay. Because there's nothing that you can do. You've already extended your, your everything. You've already done everything that you could to save up this relationship. But if they are the one who's still trying and free themselves of from the binds that's been like holding you back together then you know let them because if they're really meant to be with you they're going to come back 
because I feel like they will. It's just that they, you know, it's, it's like there's just too many clouds of confusion, too many things that's been happening at once, and you just couldn't really take it anymore, you know? And so is your partner. Now, even though you're so afraid that this person might never come back anymore, because this is what you're going to be thinking, and you're also afraid that what if there is someone else? What if this person is cheating on me? What if they just wanted to be with someone else and test the waters and then when they feel like, oh, okay, you know, it's warm enough for me to soak in, then they're just going to say goodbye to you. These are the things that's been like in your mind and you already have a, like an instinct or you already have some doubts or suspicions in yourself that this person is falling for someone or seeing someone else or messing around with someone else. Um... Kind of, um, which is younger than them, but you can still save their relationship, okay? And as I've said, that, you know, when it comes to your sex life, you know that there is something that is slowly dying or slowly withering. Uh, the ecstasy that you used to share, you know, that uh, rumbling and tumbling and wrestling that you used to do in the past, now it's... You know, it's like it's really dry and you feel like you're just making love in the desert and you're just trying to settle for a very little shade. So both of you are already looking for much more excitement or both of you are already looking for a different thing. And every time that you do it, you're only faking your feelings or you're only faking your, you know, your orgasm or something like that. But know that it, this is not all about you. Yes, it takes two to tango, but this is not just all about you. Your partner is already looking for something else, especially if they're already in their late 40s or early 50s, then definitely they're going through some midlife crisis, okay? Because the person that they are so hot, right, you know, right now is younger than them, okay? Which is, I feel like it's another, uh, well, it's a fire sign. It's a fire or water sign. Okay, um, you're gonna have your piece of glory. You just need, you, you know, you don't need to. Well, if you want to learn some more stuff or some more, you know, styles and you know, stuff like that, it's okay. But for you to think that this is the only way to please the other person, no, because I feel like they're the one who already have a problem, it's not you. Now let's take a look at your health. It seems like you need to ask around if you're, especially if you're going through some dermatological surgery or some major surgery. Um, if there is another way, try because I feel like right after going through this uh, this surgery, it's not yet. It's not going to go away. Whatever it is that you wanted to take out. Okay, so for you to avoid further damage and for you to avoid much more prolonged pain, okay, and agony, try asking around, you know, dig up some more information from the groups, ask people who've already gone through this and, you know, what happened next or whatever, what, what happened right after that. And um, I feel like you need to be a little bit more resourceful, okay, if you can do, if you can try some more herbs, some other method of, um, you know, healing, go for it. And um, I feel like you have some problems with your stones. Um, it's not in your kidney, but it's on the side of your body. Okay. And you need to lower down your intake of carbohydrates. You need to be careful in um, getting into high places. You will also be feeling a little bit nauseous. Vertigo is also another. And imbalances, um, ringing, ringing in your ears, um, dizziness or nausea. And you will feel a little bit more uncomfortable. Okay, especially that the, either you will hear too sensitive or you can't hear anything at all. So, hmm. 
And I feel like some nasal infection that you need to, you know, go for the doctor about. Anyway, as for your, um, you know, as for your Oracle cards, healer of abundance, never doubt that you can make a difference. Your creativity and ability to be innovative make you destined to succeed. It might be time to expand your career, but don't forget to leave time for family. This situation involves a part, uh, sorry, it involves a person, possibly you, who's down to earth with a gift for design or decorating. He or she's open-minded and nurturing. Two of emotion, a relationship grows closer as two people fall in love, or a current relationship grows much stronger. Friendships may deepen into a spiritual connection, mutual respect and understanding exists or will develop. Don't give up on relationships that feel challenging to you, there's still hope. Three of action, things are working out beautifully now that your ship has come in. It's time to decide what your next big project will be. You may choose to continue to build upon your successes or move on to something entirely different. Be willing to travel if necessary. This is the, uh, you know, this is your career. This is the um, the changes that you're expecting and that uh, the changes that you're kind of thinking. Anyway, that's it for you for this month, Taurus. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live video calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.